Gio, I have to start two home games now, nine goals conceding and then losing it to Rangers. Your analysis of this situation? Uh, I mean, I just finished playing, so it's hard to, it's hard to take it all in now. Uh, obviously, defensively as a unit, it's not good enough. That's pretty, pretty clear to see. Not, uh, not tight enough, not, not as together as we should be. So, uh, yeah, like I said last time, it was not good enough today defensively. And, uh, yeah, we're going to try to analyze it this week. And, you know, it's only halftime. Obviously, we dug ourselves a hole. But, uh, yeah, we're going to try to come out of it next week and uh, see what we can do there. Something you work on in training with all of these set pieces, can you sometimes feel that when you train on things that you maybe get into your head somehow in a negative way? Uh, no. I think it's just, uh, yeah, we're working on it for a reason, so it's clearly not good enough. And, uh, yeah, we're going to continue to work on it, and, uh, yeah, we'll improve. Another, I wanted to, uh, to have you today in the interview is because of the... Giovanni of uh, Rangers, of course. You named after him. How, how was that to, to play against him today? Uh, yeah, it was a nice feeling. Uh, but when it came onto the pitch, I was I was focused on playing for us, obviously. But uh, yeah, it's a nice story, and uh, yeah, we're not done yet. So I'm gonna gonna try to come and do do something next week. Good time for uh, Dortmund that their away goals are taken away. How do you see your chances now going back to Glasgow? Uh, obviously, we know it's going to be tough, but uh, if they can score four here, uh, we know the quality we have, and uh, yeah, we're going to need our our best performance, and hopefully, we can yeah turn it around. Thank you. Yeah.